Hi, I'm Josh, and today I'm going to show you how to assemble your windfall kiosk. First thing we're going to do is take our lock washers and our screws, and we're going to give each of the screws a washer. Then we're going to take our optional Kensington ClickSafe cable lock mounting plate. We're going to take the four screws and four washers, and we're just going to slide them into each of the four holes. Next, we're going to take the neck of our kiosk. We're going to line it up with the holes in the feet. And then we're going to take our screws, washers, and plate here and use it to assemble the neck to the feet. Once you've got the screws started, you take your kiosk assembly tool and use it to tighten the screws. You want to get each one started first before you tighten each of them completely. So now that we've assembled the neck and the two feet of the kiosk together, we're going to take our neck back plate that we disassembled originally and reinstall it. Before we do so, uh, if you have a power cord that you want to use to power your tablet while it's in use, uh, now is the time to install the power cord and an uh, extension cord as well that will be needed to reach an outlet. To do this, you're going to simply place the power cord for your tablet right up in the neck channel here, and the power cord will thread out the top of the neck here. So we're going to reinstall our neck back plate. We're going to align the notches in the back plate with the notches in the neck and let it rest there. Now, if you remember when you disassembled the neck back plate from the neck itself, uh, there were three different length screws. Uh, the shortest screw will go at the top of the neck. Medium length screw will go in the middle. And the longest length will go at the bottom. Next, we're going to install our tablet frame to the top of the kiosk. So once we have our neck assembled to our feet of our kiosk, we're going to take our frame of our tablet that we're going to install. We're going to take the M4 mounting screws for the frame and put them into the desired hole slots. We're going to need a Phillips head screwdriver. We're going to screw the mounting screws into the mounting holes in the kiosk. Next, we're going to take our assembly tool and we're going to take off the front faceplate of the frame. If you decided to channel a power cord up through the neck of the kiosk, you're going to want to take the end of that power cord, pull it through the center hole, and out the side mouse hole and the back plate of the frame. So next, we're going to take our iPad Air and uh, be sure to put the charging port on the side that you put your power cord. We're going to let it rest in there in our frame. We're going to take our faceplate of our frame, we're going to reinstall it using the security screws and our assembly tool. Be sure to take a second pass and make sure that all your screws are nice and tight. As a finishing touch, you're going to want to take these screw caps that were included with your kit and apply them to the back of the frame so that it covers exposed hardware like this. And that's how you assemble your windfall kiosk. If you have any questions, email us at service at hecklerdesign.com. Thanks for watching.